guys. What if they're gonna judge me? Hi YouTube. Hi YouTube. <laughs> what are we doing right yeah. now, Tiana? We're going to Bunnings, guys. We are Yay. doing some decorating of the house, of the walls. We have the permission to use sticky hooks on our walls. So I don't know. I've had a bad experience with sticky hooks in the past. They've broken many, many photo frames, mirrors, canvas prints. We're on the hunt for some good sticky hooks that aren't going to rimp off paint, but are going to stay on the walls. <laughs> That's so not heading, possible. <laughs> we're heading to Bunnings. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Go away, Dad. <laughs> and I thought I would do a little Bunnings haul. So the main reason why we went there was to obviously get our clips. So we, clips, hooks, they're hooks. Um, so we got the 2.2 .2 kilogram ones. So hopefully they are strong. We also got two packs of these 1.3 kilogram ones, which are for the photos. And even though our photo frames definitely don't weigh over a kilo, I just thought if we get the stronger ones and hopefully it will hold and not smash my frames. We also got this uh, surface cleaner for the hooks because I just want to do it right, okay? Normally I like slack off, but I just really want these to work and, and not damage my frames. And then I got three of these baskets for under the sink for a little bit of organization because the baskets that I actually had do not fit because the sink's like lower, so I have to rearrange things. These were not that expensive. They're like $1.80. So that's why I got them. And then we got two packets of these combo vacuum bags for traveling and for storage afterwards because they're good for seasonal clothes for our capsule wardrobes. So we're going to clean the walls and do the hooks and probably then do our work. for the last like half an hour this is what we've gotten with a few lines <laughs> okay guys little update on the gallery wall slowly coming together i actually have to get more frames it's not perfect still needs a little bit of straightening up but oh it looks actually really bad on camera <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is actually so much harder. I'm gonna have to go through and I have this app thing on my phone actually And it does like the measurement properly, so I'm gonna have to go through and like um, Make sure all of them are straight, but I just thought I would show you an update So we have already done four we are gonna do another four on this side and the only problem is I need Four more frames, actually. But I'll show you the pictures that we are gonna hang up. Hold in. So these are the three black ones. And then we have this gray background. But we actually have to pick up our other photos. So right here, Fedor is 12 months old and we have to pick up his six month ones. So 
we got our maternity and newborn and then we're gonna add six months and then 12 months so I'm feeling a bit stuck I am actually going to take those photos down because the hooks have to stay like weightless for 60 minutes and I just hooked them on because I need to see a visual thing when I'm sticking hooks if that makes sense so I'm gonna go take them down now <laughs> okay because they've already been up for 60 minutes without the weight and then I've just stuck them back on. But these ones are fresh hooks guys. Don't want to stuff it up. Alright so I am going to admit that I may be procrastinating. I should be filming an assignment. I have to do a presentation like a visual, uh, not a visual, like a video presentation. That's really so weird, sorry. Um, but I am actually going to stick my mirror up. So this mirror here, I love it guys. What do you think? I am um, going to put it above the couch. But Isaac was meant to clean it and he didn't. So we're going to have to clean it first. And then that hook that I stuck up has been done for... I reckon by the time we cleaned the mirror, it would have been 60 minutes. But hopefully it's straight because I win this one. I'm so bad. This is not my forte, that's for sure. Just going to let the dogs in. So if you're wondering where Isaac and Fedor are, he took Fedor to the gym so I could do my assignment. So I'm going to quickly hang up this mirror and then I'm going to do the assignment on this camera so I won't be vlogging it and I don't know. I feel like I can film YouTube fine but because this is for uni and my classmates are going to see it, I don't know. I feel very nervous. I don't want to be judged. <laughs> Okay guys, the mirror is up and I love it. I love the simplicity for the space. I know some people would be like, that's too small for the space, but I love it. I love just pops of things here and there. And this is how close my face was when I like was filming. Joking guys, joking. Oh my gosh, don't tell me that was crooked the whole time I was filming. I literally just spent the last 45 minutes trying to read the script and oh my gosh guys I, just, I probably should have practiced it but you know how it is I just wing things but if my nose ring oh no no if it's crooked and I have to edit this assignment of my crooked nose ring guys triggered triggered oh my gosh um so I just like finished I, I just went on a ramble let's be honest but I just finished my design well my design script video for my assignment and I just I'm like I'm so nervous guys I just don't know I'm too triggered I'm like what if they judge me and uh, oh my gosh I'm so bad at reading off scripts I never I just fully wing at things I have like I'm like in YouTube videos I normally do like dot points and kind of go from there and do like sub points but I'm so bad at reading word for word in a script I just I'm gonna let you in on a little secret guys you probably notice by now but I actually have a really bad tongue tie and when I get nervous I like stuff up words and it's just really bad so if you ever wonder why I like uh have it <laughs> so if you ever wonder why my pronunciation is kind of screwed see what I mean skewed <laughs> then you'll know why. I'm just like coming off a high guys. I am so like, I don't know. I just get such bad anxiety around uni stuff. And because people are going to watch this uh, are my peers. And what if they're going to judge me guys? What if they're going to judge me? Anyway, I just don't feel like this is the same as YouTube. I could never be an actor ever. I just, I'm really bad at remembering things. And I just frankly like to showcase my life in a different way <laughs> not by script okay so i'm gonna edit the assignment right now and i'll probably take you with me 
but um, yeah, it was okay. I don't know. I haven't started editing it, but the actual filming part was like okay. I did have to do it. Like it's a five minute script and it took 45 minutes. So it's going to be a long edit, but we're just going to have to get it together because it's due tomorrow. Also guys, I think it's tea time. <laughs> I'm going to make a tea. My favorite tea at the moment is this. Where is it? At the back. I should really bring it forward, but because it's the tallest tin, I have it at the back. It's this cream brulee tea too, and it's just amazing. The ingredients are vanilla, hazelnut, hazelnut, guys. It literally tastes like a freaking vegan Ferrero Rocher, and it also has like black tea and bit of sugar. So a little bit naughty, but that's okay because one to two a day i don't know i don't really drink sweet stuff where is the jug oh um i don't really drink i don't really eat sweet stuff i don't even have sugar in my tea so i guess it's kind of okay if that makes sense you know what i'm saying girl hate hot tea I mean it's okay but I hate I'm like so impatient and I burn my tongue so I accidentally put too much hot water in my tea so I'm gonna put a bit of ice cube in it to cool it down little life hack if you like to drink your tea oh sorry guys like I'm gonna be honest my house is a trash fire at the moment um yeah if you like your tea at drinking temperature add a few ice cubes not work. I just like to drink my tea immediately. 